Today, I will tell you about Hypatia, one of the most interesting and inspiring women in history. Hypatia was a scientist who lived in Alexandria in the 4th century and made significant contributions to the fields of philosophy, mathematics, and astronomy. Her father Theon was a professor of mathematics and astronomy at the University of Alexandria and taught Hypatia these subjects. Hypatia also read the works of famous philosophers such as Plato, Aristotle, Plotinus, and became a representative of the New Platonism movement. Hypatia studied in Athens and Rome, and then returned to Alexandria, where she started teaching at the Platonic School. Among her students were Orestes, who would become the governor of Alexandria, and Synesius, who would become the bishop of Ptolemaeus. Hypatia was admired and respected by everyone for both her beauty and wisdom. She tried to explain the universe with logic, mathematics, and experiments. She wrote books on mathematics and astronomy. She added comments to the works of Euclid, Diophantus, and Apollonius on elements, arithmetic, and conic sections. She worked on astronomical laws and the movements of celestial bodies. Hypatia was also a peace ambassador. She intervened in the conflicts between Christians, Jews, and pagans in Alexandria, and tried to achieve reconciliation. But this situation caused trouble for her. Cyril, the bishop of Alexandria, feared Hypatia's influence and targeted her. Cyril claimed that Hypatia was an atheist and a devil, that she bewitched the governor Orestes, and that she was against Christianity. These lies led to a fanatical Christian mob lynching Hypatia. Hypatia was captured by the mob as she left her home in 415 and taken to a church. There, Hypatia's body was torn apart and burned. Thus, one of the brightest minds in history was brutally killed. Hypatia's death marks the decline of science and philosophy and the beginning of the Dark Ages. Hypatia was a woman who showed the place of women in science, a free thinker, a brave and enlightened woman. Her life and works continue to inspire us even today. We remember Hypatia with respect and admiration. We have come to the end of this video. I hope you liked it. For more information about Hypatia, you can check out the sources below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like the video, and comment. See you in the next video, goodbye. Before we officially wrap up, there's something important we'd like to ask of you. If you enjoyed this journey into the life and legacy of Hypatia, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. It's right down there, just a click away. Your support helps us create more content like this, diving deep into the fascinating stories that history has to offer. And if you know someone who might be interested in learning more about Hypatia or any other historical figures, why not share this video with them? Spreading knowledge is a powerful way to keep the legacy of these great minds alive. Thank you for your support and for being a part of this community. Stay curious, keep exploring, and we'll see you in the next video.